Okay, we're watching the launch of SpaceX launching the NROL 108 mission, a classified mission for the National Reconnaissance Office. Here she goes. A classified spy satellite mission launched by SpaceX for the National Reconnaissance Office. That is a gorgeous shot of Falcon 9. Uh, we are in the middle of the NROL 108 mission. Falcon 9 is currently This is the SpaceX feed. For Max Q at T plus 1 minute and 12 seconds. Max Q is where the vehicle will experience the highest amount of aerodynamic pressures. Falcon is supersonic. Oop. There we go. Look at that. That's from the stage of the Falcon 9 That's rocket. Dynamic pressure. And we've passed Max Q. All is looking good with the stage one trajectory. In about a minute, we'll have five events happening back to back. Uh, first up is main engine cutoff. We also refer to that as Miko. Uh, this is where ni all nine run engines. This launch was scrubbed yesterday due to a stage second two stage second stage sensor uh, reading. Stage separation. Uh, the first and second stage will separate from one another. The third event is second engine start, or SES-1. Uh, this is where the single Merlin vacuum engine on the second stage will ignite. The fourth event is boost back burn for the first stage. And the last of these five events is fairing deploy, where we will jettison the nose cone at the top of our second stage. Uh, a reminder, again, we won't be sh broadcasting the fairing deploy at the request of our customer, but we should get audio... No fairing deploy it. at the request of the We're about NRO. We're seconds away from the first of those five events main engine cut off they don't you know they don't want to they don't want you to see the satellite so when the, once the fairing comes off you can see part of the satellite stage separation confirmed stage separation Fairing separation confirmed. And we just got the fairing, that fairing separation, separation confirmed. So the fairing, the satellite is exposed to the atmosphere now. Of the first stage performing its boost back fairing. Uh, that is a great shot. In a couple of seconds, we're expecting that boost back burn to be ending on the first stage. Stage one boost back shut down. And there it is. T plus, three minutes and 20 seconds into flight. Everything's looking great so far. Uh, with the boost back burn done, done, our first stage will be attempting its land landing in just a few minutes. Acquisition of signal from you. Land landings have a number of advantages over water landings. First, they are not subject to ocean storms that might affect the drone ship. Secondly, landing on land significantly streamlines post-launch processing of the recovered first stage. We'll be able to refurbish boosters right here at our facilities at the Cape, rather than waiting for the drone ships to return to port. And these types of efforts support our future goal of a 24-hour turnaround from landing to reflight. So on screen... Both of those views of are of the first stage. The left this is the first stage is coming back. Of our first stage, uh, looking downward, and the right hand side is a tracking shot from the ground. As our first stage makes its descent back towards Earth. Acquisition signal to Hampshire. There's first stage returned to Earth. That's nitrogen as gas SpaceX has made so famous. As you can Other companies are actually trying to do this also to bring their stages back. back. And uh, some have been successful, and others are still working on it. Has two more burns left. Uh, I talk about that more at my Space Gap podcast. Will reignite. This helps to slow the stage down as it re-enters the upper parts of the Earth's atmosphere. Uh, where and my Space Gap podcast is now heard on Spotify as of yesterday. It's uh, 
you can go to spacegabpodcast.com and there's a link to the Spotify link and also the anchor.fm link and the RSS feeds are all there. Second stage following me nominal trajectory. Second stage seems to be doing great. Uh, if you've been watching our previous webcasts, usually at this point we have a view of our first and second stages. Again, as a reminder, uh, per our customers' request, we will not be showing any views of the second stage. So for now, we'll be watching. I'll come back stage. to this stage feed with uh, once landing, landing is going to occur. Landing zone one and four. Stage one is on its way down. Here's re- the entry burn for the stage one the Falcon three stage one. Burn. The entry burn has started. This burn lasts for a total of 26 seconds. 26 second burn, they said. As it's coming back to land on Earth to be reused. A major cost savings effort by SpaceX. And that's why so many other companies are trying to complete a Launch like this with burn. returning uh, hardware. About 40 seconds away during the first stage landing burn, a single Merlin engine will relight. relight. And as you can see, it's coming back now fifth landing attempt at landing zone one to the Cape. Florida. About 25 seconds later, you can see that uh, we can start to see. Burn start up. There's the Cape below. Now the landing burn is That's starting now. Relight. Here comes Falcon 9 for its fifth landing attempt Station at landing zone one. See some of the launch pads there. Look at that. There's, there's where hell happens right there. Stage one landing light deployed. Stage two start of terminal guidance. And Falcon 9 does it again. That's five times for this booster. Five and times for this booster, this Falcon 9 first stage booster. Falcon 9 return to Earth for reuse. Uh, congratulations to uh, all those that have been working on uh, today's mission. Uh, as we mentioned earlier, at the request of our wow. customer, the cool. National Reconnaissance.